gonna kill you. He went corrupting potion. What the fuck? I've never seen that. Yasuo went corrupting potion. Whoa. I mean, to be honest, I feel like that's not even bad. Given the circumstance where you're just getting Q-spammed. I have to break his shield because I'm going to try and solo. Minion block, bruv. I almost flashed. I almost flashed on that Yasuo. I almost flashed. I, you know, I actually pressed the flash button, but I think I got knocked up. If I can break his shield, it's always worth. It's the only way to kill him. Can't all in him with his passive. Get mana flow banned. Oh, you get everything. I'm not going to blow that barrel. I don't want to fuck the wave. It's a slow pushback into me. This really tests the mental of your your laner to have patience like this. What the fuck is Heimer doing here? I like this jungler, he understands the win con.
Surprised he didn't just ult. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck, man? Dude, I'm in I'm in love with Mana Flow Ban right now. I feel like Mana Flow Ban Gathering Storm, like the Mana Flow Ban counteracts the fact that all your runes are scaling if you go bullet, and it gives you some sort of oomph in lane phase, which is quite nice. Because every time you press Q in the early lane before Mythic, you're actually getting a refund on your mana. So like as an example, GP's Q got nerfed by 5 mana. Or it got buffed by 5 mana, right? So negative 5 plus mana flow band is... I just wasted a biscuit. Ugh. Mana flow band's 25, right? That's 30 mana plus a Q. Your base mana is 55. So you're only spending... 25 mana for the first Q. That's actually not bad. 25 mana for one Q. And you can proc it with a barrel, giving you more mana anyways. And it's only because you go scaling, right? Like, you need some sort of lane phase punch if you go bullet, or else you're just worthless, you're, you're too slow. Now it's useless. Now now the rune is irrelevant, but for the sake of the early game not being terrible, it feels okay. That crit was disgusting. I made so much money from Bullet already, it's pretty insane. Two fifty four. Two fifty four from that and then Q passive is uh two thirty mid now. I'll destroy uh this guy. The alerts are disabled, it's not my doing. It's not me. Oh, that was a good juke, lol. Lee Sin's bot, I have to kill him right now. Lee Sin is bot, next barrel I go. Heimer's actually TPing bot, he's abandoning it. He just abandoned all of his plates to me. Oh 
Oh my god, that's so bad. I got every mid plate, now I'm gonna get every top plate. Do one more, I'm actually leaving. They're all pathing. Oh shit. My daddy's got bomb. Shit. Oh, 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 oh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> my god. <laughs> oh my god. If I get 13, I go psycho on their team. They're not that good. Tell me, if you're smart enough, what item could they release to make Gangplank so piss broken? What would be the main stat on that item? Yeah, crit and CDR. Yep. Give Gangplank a crit CDR mythic and the game is over. He would be so broken with crit CDR mythic. It would just be like the old Triforce with the crit CDR. And there'd be nothing you could do because he would just spike it like one item. Or two items, rather. 40% crit, two items, 360, 480. With bullet and all these other fucking runes that make money, it's just insane. Shield bow? No. Shield bow doesn't have CDR. Shield bow is exclusively bought for the, uh, the crit. And even then, it's just a dog shit mythic. Like, well, you, you buy it for the defensive stats, implying you're fighting 15 assassins, but... Th the one thing that kills it is not having CDR. CDR makes items, like, super cracked. Navori works on barrels, yeah. Just the item is garbage. You okay? What? No, I wasn't. Oh, they're all fucking dead. You all gonna die. Nice and slow. Guys, this is where they all get munched by the uh, damage. Oh, why aren't they all dead? Oh, that's a one part. They're all dead. <laughs> I'm not even level 13. I need to get 13. That was a good one part. I'm playing very phenomenally today. Like, every game is just hyper consistent. Even if I've lost the game, it's very, very good for me. They yoink all their camps for 13. Please give me 13. Please. I go dusk. I don't. I don't fuck with prowlers. I prefer the uh, defensive stats, the invis. Prowlers is really good, but I just like being in and out. They're both fine. Both mixed mythics are completely fine. I made challenger playing dusk blade GP. You could do it. GP is just broken, regardless. Oh, they're all top. I say you should have kept it. I should just go IE and just murder all of them. I think I will. Say fuck collector.
Although Collector, like, one-shots all of them. Three guaranteed crits, imagine that on GP now. Imagine Storm Razor on GP now. Fuck the combo up, whatever. There was no crit on that barrel, but it still worked. I fucked it up. I wanted to flash Q, EEQ, but then the fucking Nico ran at us instead of away. I've got so much money, fuck this. Alright, let's go. Time to die. Time to die, peasants. Oh, sweet Jesus. I've got the 70% crit infinity edge. Oh, sweet baby beans. Pretty big. First strike is only 400. About 5. It gets more. Like, when I if I crit in a team fight and I hit 3 people, I'll make like 500 gold. It's kind of disgusting. Just kind of, you know. Sweet baby beanus. I say don't flip Baron and just try and uh, flip the midline. There's one down. That was a 14, no collector. Just out of my reach, bruv. Try for the end. I'm gonna back up. If they get engaged on, I wanna just blow everyone up. The fuck is this Heimer turret? <laughs> he just gave up. I say, make them suffer. Make them, make them bleed. Let's one shot Nico. Three, two. Oh, no crit, no shit, no crit, eh? Ezreal, Ezreal, look, Ezreal. Dude, I'm gonna have one good GP game, and they're going to suffer in their fountain. I'm sorry, they must. They must suffer in their fountains. Good jungler, GG.